the next chapter of the story quest, which I will be doing later today. Progress has been pretty good. I feel like I've been slowing down by doing... I've been doing a lot of the exploration quests, which unlocks a lot of the map, but I feel it feels a little slow for gaining um, union experience, union level experience, even though it gives 2000 per, they are fairly long and I do, I'm not skipping everything. I do kind of want to grab an, a bit of a, an understanding of where the quests are. So I feel like that's been a slowdown for me. My next priority is obviously going to be the main story next. But another thing I haven't done, which does give a lot of experience, is just unlocking all the teleport points. And I think that's what I'm going to do after I unlock or after I complete the uh, main story. And there's also parts where I haven't unlocked yet. Along here, this area, not too much, but I'm, I'm, I'm making slow but steady progress so far. It's definitely not the most ideal. And unlocking level 20 has definitely like brought in a couple of things for me to do. Um, I waited till I reached union level 20 to do the weekly bosses for the most part. And so I did that. And so I'm going to be working on that. But now I've kind of reached a forked on the road. I've been kind of investing a lot on Rover and she's been my main and I do really enjoy her. And I'm going to continue using her for sure. But I got really lucky on the standard banner and I now have both Verena and now I have Kalcharo and Kalcharo is going to be one of my main DPS's that I'm going to be focused on. I actually got him to level 40. I actually no longer have any uh, experience mats for characters and all that stuff. I also don't really have a good weapon for him because I picked four star rover weapon. So he's ra lo lo uh, rocking a three star weapon. So he's going to be a he, he he'll probably feel a little weak on that end. Um, but because I plan on wishing for Yin Lin, Kalchar and Yin Lin are going to be great together. So I've kind of been splitting my investments between Rover and Kalchar for now. And it might bone me a little bit with character experience, but it is what it is as far as I'm concerned. Um, but the other thing I'm doing is like the weekly bosses. So I'm also trying to get like skill levels as well. And yeah, I think right now it's just really confusing for me and a decision needs to be made if I continue with Rover or if I go full in Kalcharo. And I think I'm going to be doing both for the most part. And that's just going to be my main focus. And honestly, doing those two might just mean that for now in the overworld, I'll just have Rover and Kalcharo on the team and then and then Verena as well. And that will kind of just be my team for now. And I think that's just going to be fine. That's just going to be fine. That's kind of my plan for now. At least that's what I'm aiming for. And the other thing is I have to decide. I finally unlocked being able to level up skills. And that's kind of just like some resource management I'm going to have to start thinking about on whether or not I want to increase that on Rover and or Kalcharo as well. And so that's just something I'm just going to have to decide on. But I think my prog I'm pretty happy with my progress so far, all things considered.